Hey, listen, thank you all very much. Thank you, Scott Brennan, for being a great state chairman. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you all for being here. I'm sorry, I was, I was just coming back to, on a plane and I just uh, got, had got in a little bit late. I was subbing for Bruce at a fundraiser that he couldn't be at and uh, last night. So, uh, yeah, we did all right. We raised some more money for the campaign last night. Yeah. Yeah. Late getting in here, but thank you all for being out here. Uh, I can tell you that, uh, uh, you know, in the debate today, by the way, anybody here from Simpson? 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 Simpson. Now, I understand the Simpson debate team just uh, last weekend defeated four other colleges in their open, and won over 50% of the awards. So, so uh, Bruce is going to do the same thing to Joni Erst, what Simpson did all those other colleges. So again, we're, uh, I can tell you what you're going to see in this debate. First of all, I have never in my 40 years ever seen a press report from a debate, mine or anybody else's, where the press reported that someone won and someone lost. That will never happen. At most, you're going to get a little bit of this and a little bit of that. But here's what's going to come out of this debate tonight. What's going to come out of it are Iowans are going to see Bruce Brady. And what they're going to see is they're going to see a person with deep and abiding Iowa values, real Iowa values, not phony, drummed up Iowa values. They're going to see a Bruce Brady that is caring and compassionate. And concerned and concerned about our neighbors and our children's future. They're going to see a Bruce Braley with strength of character, not wishy-washy, not one time for this and a little bit later for that. They're going to.